Hey friend, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sandra. Today I have for you my January update for that 70s pan. This was created by my friend Kim and Cece. So these two ladies created a project centered around the 70s and they have 70 prompts to go along with it, which is wild very very creative on their end so i'm just gonna go ahead and get started i think i'm gonna start with my rollouts today um so i do have several <laughs> so i have for funky lights i have my rose ink bronzer and i did use this the seven times and then for concrete patio, I brought in my About Face Shadow Stick in Oxide. I just had it. No, I don't know where it is. Okay. <laughs> so I did use this seven times as well. I didn't find this to be that impactful, honestly. Um, the NYX Jumbo Stick in Milk, I feel, is way more impactful than this one if you're looking for like a white base to help your shadows pop um next popular pottery i actually have an empty i was able to finish off my earth harbor marina biome brightening ampule um this was a little baby but it did take me a little bit to get through um it felt more like an oil than like a serum like a normal serum texture that i'm used to but i did i did enjoy using it um i just i don't know it was different than i expected <laughs> And I like that it was blue. But it was nice. I would use that again. Um, next, for stereo systems, I had brought in one, two, three, five um, colored eyeliners. And I did get my two uses on each of those. And then for dark tones, I brought in a blue nail polish. And I did get two uses on that. The remnants are on my nails right now and on my tootsies. So I have those. And then for push button phones, I actually finished these in December and I had finished Makeup Forever Mist and Fix setting spray. Um, I'm sure if I dig through my empties, I can find it, but um, it was in my year end empties. <laughs> and then another really exciting one for um, crochet blankets, I actually finally hit pan on filter. It's a little baby pan, but it's there. I probably should have used it one or two more times <laughs> to make it a little more visible, but yes, very exciting. I finally hit pen on that. Um, okay, so starting with what I'm still working on and what I am bringing in. So for 27 record players, I am working on my Patchology. I have everything in this cute little heart basket my sister and my niece gave me. Um, so I'm working on the Patchology eye patches. I'm about done with them. I think I have like four pairs left, maybe six. There's 15 total in here, but I feel like, I feel like it was more. Um, so these, um, I've been getting into the habit of using them more consistently. So there's those. And it went from 98.7 to 75.7. I still have my, um, the Sexy Hair Big Root Pump. I've used that 6 out of 7. Um, so that's still in. <laughs> Next for textured walls, I'm working on my Nomad Iceland palette. I actually have the purple, the purple tapped in the middle like a halo eye. So I'm wearing this one today. Um, so the prompt calls for wearing off the pattern. So yeah, still gonna keep using that one. Um, for pendant lights, I brought in my mini Bad Gal Bang Mascara. So I started using this one recently. I have it on my top lashes today mixed with something else. Yeah, it only went down like 0.1 grams, so. <laughs> and then for shag carpeting, I am working on my ColourPop lip liner. So I have a story about that one. May look very different. 
Let me see if I can pop this up. They look very different. Little baby. <laughs> so I was going to use it one day and this whole piece fell off. <laughs> so I had to sharpen it down to, so the word pencil is completely gone and I can take this out. So, you know, it's old. I honestly don't know what to do with it. It still works just fine. Um, I don't know if I should just keep it into finish now because that was kind of cheating how much fell out. Like that's a, that's a good bit. So I think I'm just going to toss this. I just wanted to show you guys. Um, and I think I'm just going to keep this in until it just stops working. So yeah, I think that's my new goal. I'm just going to work on it until it stops working. The project ends, whichever comes first. <laughs> so there's that one. Um, and so the new weight is 4.5. Last time it was 5.7. And now for vinyl tablecloths, I'm working on the Benefit um, face palette. I don't really have a goal for this one. I'm just kind of using it. So, yeah. I wasn't ready to put it away. So I'm just working on that one now. And then uh, for rec rooms... I brought in a blue mascara and this also just went down like 0.1 and here is the wand if you haven't seen it. I like this one. It's on my lower lashes right now. Um, okay, there's that one. And then for Pyrex dishes, I still haven't used that so. <laughs> Next for pattern paper, I brought in the House Labs Liquid Shadow. I had everything nice and organized so it's this one it sucks because it's not as impactful as it once was it looks beautiful I might have to start using it with like a glitter glue or something to help it like stick a little better um but I've got in three out of seven uses on this one then next I have for chrome finishes, I'm working on my Hourglass Diffused Heat. And then I've got in three out of 70 uses. Um, I should pick up on that. Um, next I have my, for macrame, I have my Amika Dry Shampoo and my goal is to finish this one. This one is feeling pretty light. I would say maybe like one more month and it should probably be gone. It's feeling super duper light. So that one went from 83.6 to 71.9. And then for 8-track, I have the K18 uh, leave-in hair mask. And so this one, I don't, think, I don't think I can see through. Oh, I can't see through it. Maybe I'll mark it. <laughs> that one went from 40.4 to 36.8. My goal is to finish it. And then... For pod chairs, I'm working on my peach and lily spray. Like I mentioned, this will probably take me the entire project. So I went from the blue to the brown line, but it also is not a focus of mine right now. I kind of just use it. I need to go, I need to take it back into my bathroom. So when I finish the spray I'm currently working on, I can just start using this one right away. Um, but it is a very, very fine mist. So it's going to, it's going to take a bit. And I knew that going in, but it's fine. Next, uh, for Exposed Brick, I have the Give Beauty Original Recipe, and I've used it two out of seven times. Little baby. And then I have a new one is for 36 Fondue Pot, a food-themed product. And for this one, I'm bringing in my Hey Honey Sweet Treat Wild Berry and Honey Yogurt Recovery Mask. And I would like to use this one seven times and it's brand new. I don't think I've even opened it. Nope. Brand new. So I would like to use this um, seven times. And then that one is coming in at 73.6 for 37 Big Wheels Loud Packaging or Brightly Covered Colored. That's also a new one. So I'm bringing in my In Beauty Lip Oil in Candy Apple. 
So this is pretty bright. It smells really good too. And this is the applicator. So I would like to finish this. I don't know how long that'll take. Um, I've never tried to finish one. Um, another new one is 38 Strawberry Shortcake, and that is a scented product, and I completely forgot to go get it, but it's my Bath & Body Works uh, body cream in sweater weather. So I'll weigh it and then put that in the description, and then I'll show you guys next time what it looks like because I forgot to go get it. But I do want to finish that one. It's in my bathroom because I'm that's what I'm using right now. Um, for tie-dye, a colorful packaging or product, and I want to use my Kaleidos Futures. Sorry, I'm in class. I'm on break. Uh, no. Let me mute it. <laughs> it scared me. I was like, oh no. I hope they can't hear me. So, I have worked on this previously. I think I want to try and like hit pan in one of these because I'm pretty close, especially like on the pink. So, that's my goal. I haven't used this palette in a while. Um, and then for mini skirts, a sample or a mini product, and I would like to bring in my NYX Plump Finish uh, Setting Spray into Finish. This is brand new. I haven't tried that one, so I'm excited to try it, especially right now in like the colder months. And then for the last new one is going to be for 42 Maxi Dresses, and that's going to be Large Packaging. And I miss playing with my Glam Light palette. So I'm bringing back the Glam Light Ice Cream Dream palette. I had this in, I think Project 10 uses or something else. So it's rather large, but so bright and pretty. So I would like to use this one, I think, seven times. I don't know. We'll see. If I haven't gotten my fill of it at seven uses, then... Or should I do 70? Or no pen left behind? Let's do 70. Yeah, let's do 70. This is so pretty. Okay, so 70 uses on this one. Very excited. So, um, how I started the project at the end of my video <laughs> is it's I started with seven and then every update i'm bringing in the next seven so i should have 42 in right now because i think it's a six month update so i should be at 42 right now and i'm just kind of doing it that way um so i want to get you set up i want to try all the um prompts so um yeah I love Kim. She's so fun. So I really wanted to join in on this project. Um, like I mentioned in other videos, I am feeling a bit of like pan fatigue. So I'm kind of trying to like take it slow right now and, you know, kind of feel it out. You know, today is uh, January 29th. So it's the first month of the year. And I was kind of trying to like kind of just give myself the freedom to kind of just dabble in my collection and just use what I wanted to use. But I'm still using a lot of Project Pan items. Um, you know, I just, I feel like I just need a little break. Um, but yeah, I am still Project Panning and I cannot wait to see everyone else's update. That's it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you on my next one.